Cray or Kalamazoo. Hey, hey, everyone. How you doing? It is me, Timothy, doing Cray for Kalamazoo. A town not too far from us had a tragedy last night that occurred in their town. And some Uber driver went on a crazy nut and started shooting people. First, he went to a apartment complex and asked the lady about something and shot her. And then, about 10 o'clock last night, he went to a car dealership and shot a father and a son. And then, after that, he went to a cracker barrel in a in a Texas township and shot some women there and shot a 14 year old I guess the 14 year old is in critical condition at the hospital right now and the lady at the apartment building she it's going to survive, but the father and son, they died at the car lot. And the women at Cracker Barrel, a couple of women from our town was there and got shot. This Uber driver got in trouble, and now he's in jail because he got caught after doing all of that. But uh, pray for Kalamazoo. Well, yeah, I encourage all of you. Uh, that has never happened in that town. And it's just crazy, man. Very crazy. I guess some dude they interviewed today well, on the news that he was in there in with the Uber. Uber driver, he said the guy went crazy. The driver went crazy. He was doing about 80 miles an hour on the road. And, oh my God, it's, the dude said he jumped out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Say a prayer for a Kalamazoo, won't you? And things like that has never happened over there. Usually it's a mellow yellow town. <laughs> Not last night, that's for sure. And I just hope this guy will commit suicide because he's not going to see light after that. And I tell you, I don't know why people like that have guns. I think they need to do mental background check on people to see if they're capable of having guns, but they'll, they'll probably never find out why he did it. Just lost his mind, I guess, and, and had a wife and some kids, and uh, ruined his life. Ruined his life. Well, I want to give some shout out to some brand new subscribers that have subscribed to my channel. I want to welcome a Sean Williams. Hi, Sean Williams. Welcome to my channel. Hey, Swedes Vlog. Welcome to my channel. On Q Princess. Welcome to my channel. Sweet Sunny Day 31, welcome to my channel. Michael Myers, welcome to my channel. Ma Z3 Graxi, welcome to my channel. And Matthew Puddock, welcome to my channel. Feel free. To put in a description box about your guys' channel. That way my other subscribers can check you out 
and subscribe to you. So if uh, you guys could do that, put a little description about your channel in the comment box below, I would really appreciate it. That way my other subscribers could probably check out your channel and subscribe to you. So if you guys could do that, I would really appreciate it. And thanks for subscribing to my channel, and I hope you guys will enjoy it. Well, how was your Sunday out there? I hope everybody's Sunday went a okay for them and everything. And how was the weather for everybody out there? Ours here in Michigan wasn't too bad today. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Well, one minute it was sunny, then cloudy, then sunny, then cloudy. But it wasn't too bad at all. But now things are supposed to change. <laughs> Our temperatures could get back down to normal about in the 30s and everything after being in the 60s and 50s but now things are supposed to change and I guess we're supposed to get a snowstorm coming up this week they're saying but they don't know how much yet we'll find out on the news this week to see how much we're supposed to get but yeah winter's coming back <laughs> Doesn't want to leave us yet. Doesn't want to leave us yet. <laughs> what do y'all got planned for the rest of this Sunday? Hope your plans are good, whatever you have. Not much for us. Just chilled today and, well, I went out for a walk today and then after my walk, then after that, came home and chilled until I took my son to our local library so he could get some DVDs there and then after that we stopped at family fair to get what we're gonna was gonna have for supper it had um, meatloaf with bacon on it that was pretty good I like that and we had some meatloaf for dinner tonight and then after that came home for a little bit had our dinner and well made up dinner then had dinner and watched um the Daytona 500. That was pretty good. I really enjoyed that. Watched that. And then after that, had our dinner. And then after that, took my son down to Kmart so he could get some hands. And then after that, came back home and just been home chilling. Been watching our local news that was on at 5 o'clock. Kind of surprised me. It was on. I thought golf was going to be on. <laughs> They had golf on their sister station, so they could talk about what happened last night. And, uh, just terrible things, terrible things. But, yeah. Watch that. Now watching um, uh, Northwoods at Ball on um, Animal Planet until... Uh, 9 o'clock, then going to be watching uh, Long Island Medium with Teresa Caputo. And, and then that will be my Sunday, people. And probably catch some of um, uh, Fast Lane, that WWE event. Probably will catch that off. So and that will be my Sunday. Yeah, that will be my Sunday. My wonderful Sunday. My awesome Sunday. <laughs> oh, I want to <clears throat> say sorry. To, uh, not my fault. I'm sorry for what happened yesterday. Uh, why I you had got a lot of videos from me. The reason why I did that was I use um YouTube edited, and. The only way to, for me to use it is I have to upload videos. And I know you said you, you feed got all my videos. I'm sorry for that. I don't got no other editing I'm, that I use. I just use um, YouTube editing. And that's the only way for me to use it. YouTube editing is to upload it. And then I can use it then. But. There's no other way to use it without uploading a video, so I'm sorry and for doing that if um, you're watching this tonight. Uh, yeah, sorry for that, and sorry for everyone else <laughs> that got 
got it also that clogged up your feed and everything. But yeah, I don't have no other editing. And that's the only editing I use whenever I do edit. I use uh, YouTube editing. But sorry for that. Not my fault. I know he was pretty upset about it and complained about it and and everything, but uh, very sorry for that. Very sorry. And I know you said to try longer videos, but every time, you know, I do a longer video, then somebody you know, says, well, do short videos because people like short videos instead of long videos. I don't know. <laughs> uh, sorry for that. Well, everyone just wanted to do pray for Kalamazoo. Will y'all do that? Um, put put a hashtag and pray for Kalamazoo. And hope y'all enjoyed this video and everything. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up, won't you? And also, uh, if you're new and came along this video, hit that red subscribe button below, won't you? Yeah, please hit it, and that way you can check out my other videos I have up because I got plenty of them for you to check out. So feel free to check some out. That way, share some with your family and friends. Yeah, share them. That way they can check me out, and if they like me, they'll come and subscribe. And that way it will help me grow and get big. <laughs> but please do that, won't you? Please do that. Well, again, everyone, y'all take it easy and have a good one. Hey, and if any of you out there are getting close to going into Monday or stepping into Monday or already into Monday, well, happy Monday. And if you're still into Sunday and rocking out of Sunday, well, happy Sunday. And again, please pray for Kalamazoo and pray for that 14-year-old. And that hopefully she'll make it and everything. And we'll say a prayer for her because uh, that shouldn't have happened to her. You know, her life might be uh, have took been taken away, but and now she's on you know on life support and trying to survive and just say a prayer. Say a prayer for her and. For people in Kalamazoo and everybody else. Again, y'all take it easy. Have a good one. And thanks for watching. And I'll be talking to all of you real soon out there.